Brad Sidwell, who is the Vice President and General Manager for LexisNexis, one of those. Uh, Brad, where do you fit in the LexisNexis organization? So we have, um, Lexis has a business unit approach to their software products, and so I have the privilege of uh, being in charge of the interaction business unit, uh, which is a CRM tool for, uh, especially for law, specific for law firms, but also our professional services firms. Oh, great. Well, I want to find out a little bit about that in just a minute, but first just wanted to get your impression of ILTA 2010. I'd say it's, uh, it's been high energy. Um, you know, a lot of that probably has to do with the fact that we're in Vegas, but uh, at the same time, I think that um, all the vendors have a lot of compelling stuff to talk about this year. Um, you know, people are uh, ready and willing to listen to those things this year. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, the last couple years have uh, all been hard on from a business standpoint. Uh, people are coming uh, sort of thirsting for um, solutions to what's going on in their lives, and so uh, the energy level's been real high, and, and the facility's been great. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, and the, uh, the interaction with all the customers, we love getting out here and bumping elbows, so to speak. Mm -hmm. uh, so it's been a great show for us, it really has been. Great. Okay, well, speaking of announcements, I know that you're um, announcing Interaction 6.0 for Microsoft Outlook. We sure Tell did. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, it's, uh, it's been a, um, a real um, collaborative effort between our, us and our customers, and, and, and in fact, uh, you know, prospects of ours, um, to look at how we can take Interaction and all the powerful data that's in that database uh, and expose it to folks in a way that is more consumable uh, and fits in with where they live on a daily basis. Um, and so we have chosen uh, to go with uh, Microsoft Outlook as the place that people are living most of the time these days. Mm -hmm. um, and through a partnership with uh, Microsoft and, and being able to talk to their technical folks who are educating us on how to build applications for off the Office platform, mm -hmm. um, we are now delivering in an unparalleled fashion access to all of the smart, intelligent, powerful information from interaction right within Outlook where the attorneys and other folks live. Great. Okay, well as you uh, may know, we're doing a thought leader initiative for Inside Legal. So I wanted to just as a wrap up, get an idea from you of when you think of a thought leader, what characteristics do you think of? Well, you know, having, as we talked about a little bit off, off camera, um, you know, we've uh, been in the business a long time. Uh, and you look for those people who have um, not just the ability to absorb all the information around them, but to, um, to analyze, process um, that kind of information uh, and have um, real insight into how, um, whether it's a product or a service, um, can really impact um, the way that, that we all service our firms and service our industry. Um, and I think it has to be, um, so it has to fit a couple of criteria when you think about those, those leaders. Um, they, ha they have to have meaningful things to say. Mm -hmm. um, they have to have um, um, been grounded in, in being well, very well informed um, about those things. Um, but I think there's an innovation piece to that too. Um, you can't sort of just repeat what you've heard before. Mm -hmm. um, there's a, there's a, a newness that needs to be there, and maybe if it's just a slight nuance versus you know, you know, completely revolutionary. Um, but those are the people that I want to talk to. Mm -hmm. um, those are the people that we want to become, frankly, um, is to be able to, um, to know what um, solutions people uh, are looking for, know what our products are capable of, and bring them together in an innovative way. Great. Well, thank you so much. We'll be having more information on our Thought Leader program as well as information on Lexus on InsideLegal.com. Thank you, Brad, thank you. for really taking the time to speaking with us today.